Hey, welcome back to Pre-K Sunday School. It's great to be both in person with you for elementary Sunday School and online for Pre-K Sunday School. Hope you all are doing well this week. Well, this week, we continue with the story of Jesus and Jesus calling his first disciples. And those first disciples that Jesus called weren't necessarily who everyone expected. But when Jesus called them, they came and followed him. Well, with that, let's head on in for our story. Here's our story. The Disciples Jesus told everyone he met, Repent! Stop the bad things you're doing and start doing good. One day, Jesus was at the seashore, and a crowd gathered to listen to hear what he had to say. Jesus hopped onto a fishing boat, so more people could see and hear him. Thanks for letting me use your boat, Jesus said. Then he said to the fish fishing brothers, Simon and Andrew, I want to thank you with lots of fish. Throw out your nets. We'll try, they sighed. Simon and Andrew put their nets into the water. But we fished all night and caught absolutely nothing, they explained to Jesus. Suddenly they felt their nets tug. They were overflowing with fish. Rip, pop, snap. The nets were so full that they were breaking. The brothers pulled in so many fish that their boat started to sink. Help, they called to their friends in another boat. We have too many fish. James and John rushed in to the rescue. The weight of the fish almost took their boat under two. They knew that their friend Jesus must be someone special. He was the one who told them to catch those fish. Hey, Simon and Andrew. Hey, James and John. Follow me, Jesus called to them. Let's catch people instead of fish. Splash! The two sets of brothers dropped their nets into the sea. They were not fishermen anymore. Now they were disciples. Now they would follow Jesus. Jesus met a tax collector at his office. Hey, Matthew, follow me, Jesus called. Let's collect people instead of money. Clink, Matthew the tax collector dropped his coins to the ground. He was not a tax collector anymore. Now he was a disciple. Now he would follow Jesus. Jesus met seven others that day. Philip, Bartholomew, Thomas, another James, Thaddeus, another Simon, and Judas. Follow me, Jesus said to each of them. Crash, boing, boom. They all stopped and dropped what they were doing. Now they were disciples. Now they would follow Jesus. Jesus and his twelve friends, the disciples, shared the workload with many other followers, including Mary Magdalene, Joanna, and Susanna. No matter where he went, Jesus called for men and women, boys and girls, to drop what they were doing and follow him. That's our story. Well, Jesus called, called to fishermen and tax collectors. Jesus called to men and women, Jews and Gentiles, people of all walks of life. And Jesus calls to each one of us. And may we, like those disciples, arise and follow God, filling the world with love. Well, know that we love you. If anything we can do for you, let us know. We'll see you next time. Mm -hmm.